And welcome back, this is Baller Scuba with more Let's Play Demon Souls. I'm joined as always by our still kind of confused knight, Baller Scuba. When we last left off, I went through the game for uh, the first time, and I apparently made quite a few mistakes, and people were pointing them out to me, so we'll, we'll talk about it a little bit as we continue forward. I'm back in the Nexus, um... I'm not entirely sure what I can do here. Uh, I double checked uh, about levels. Apparently I have leveled up. Uh, I just don't get anything out of it just yet. As you can see, I'm still level four. So that probably means something. Uh, but um, I can't uh, actually do anything yet. I have to keep playing the game and kind of hope for the best. Uh, I can talk to you. And I can forge weapons for you. Right. So I can try to upgrade weapons. That would be ideal for me, but um, I need shards of hardstone, which I haven't been able to get yet. Um, we are going to try to figure out something else instead. Uh, I'm thinking that possibly I can, well, I can try to repair. Um, the long sword probably needs to be repaired quite a bit. Uh, the mail breaker and the kite shield. Um, yeah, most of my stuff is just going to be two repairs right now. That it, it doesn't seem right, but uh, that's what I'm going to go with for now. All right, uh, let's try to buy something as well. Um, from what I understand, there are better weapons for me out there. Um, so... Yeah, none of this sounds particularly good to me. Um, from what I understand, it goes strength, magic, dex... Or is it strength, dexterity, magic, faith? Something similar to that. That's what those indicators actually mean. Um, so for now, I'm just going to hold off on buying anything. Um, yeah. You come back alive. Yeah, I'll, I'll try. Uh, I was right that the, uh, the Archstone of the Small King does lead me to the first level. Um, so we're going to go back to the Bulletarian Palace and uh, we're going to run around a little bit. Because um, there's definitely some stuff for me to do there. Uh, who the hell is Baldwin? Well, no, Baldwin was the guy I was talking to, right? Then who's Blacksmith Ed? We might find out eventually. Um, there was apparently some stuff that I could do in uh, the first area that I did not find. Uh, so we're going to go back and try to take care of that and, you know, try to avoid dragons. Um, because dragons seem bad to me. Um, so the big uh, piece of advice, we'll go with that, that I got was to lock on to pretty much every enemy that I'm fighting. Um, I wasn't doing that. Uh, not because, well, one, I did forget, uh, but also, uh, because I didn't think it was going to be super useful for me unless I was up against a boss. But, uh, locking on does seem to help, actually. And down you go. And I will take some of your souls. Um... Last time I went that way, we're gonna go this way. We're gonna we're gonna try to explore around a bit. Oh, well, so much for that. I can't go that way. Alright, lock on to him. There we go. Oh, you have something for me. I could probably use as much crescent moon grass as I can get. So it looks like I can't go this way until I unlock it, so so much for going that way. Um, we will eventually make progress, I swear. Uh, like I said, I'm up to soul level four. That doesn't necessarily count as progress right now, though. Alright, I'll go for you. Or I could just kill both of you at once. It does feel like I'm getting stronger, but... You know, as far as I can tell, the damage is the same. Although I did repair, and that might have done the trick. What? No. That way. 
Oh, I finally got hit. Took a while. Now, locking on is definitely the way to go. Uh, which is probably why I believe five different people told me about it. <laughs> yeah. I did mention that this was my first time playing the game several times. Some people are nice about advice, others not so much. But uh, that's enough about that. We're, we're going to move on. We're going to try to find my way to victory. I don't feel so bad because the, uh, the guides pretty much told me that um, the red-eye guy uh, that I really did not stand a chance of beating, um, I don't stand a chance of beating him. There's like a gimmick that I could use to beat him, but in terms of like actually fighting him and winning, yeah, there's too many enemies here. I can't, I can't really lock on. Okay. Let's, uh, eat that. Okay. Uh, yeah, apparently I need to be, like, level 30 or so, uh, before I can stand a chance against that guy, so. Considering I'm only level 4 and I don't have access to really use the levels up. Did he just jump to his doom? He did, but I don't think I got... Oh, I did get his souls! Hooray! Uh, that's still not the way I want to go. So yeah, we're going to take the shortcut again. Because um, apparently there's just stuff up here that I didn't deal with. I should check bodies every time. Uh, apparently the red striped ones here are explosive. So if you hit them with... Um, hit them with a firebomb, they'll explode. Alright, nobody in here. Okay, so we're back up top here. So if I lock on to you, to the blue eye guy. Okay. I need to get some of my stamina back here. All right. No! I'm trying to time a parry here. That is not easy. Okay. I can't... I can't parry that. Okay. Noted. Okay. I should have parried there. I don't get, like, bonuses for backstabbing or anything. And I'm trying to do the parry while holding my shield up, and that's proving difficult. Ugh. God. Oh, you can heal too, can't you? Oh. Well, that changes things. Yeah, I need stamina just to d defend myself. So far, I'm not doing as well as I did before. <laughs> this isn't a good sign. There we go. I somehow managed that. Give me whatever you got. Two half moon grass. Let's eat one of those. Okay. So that didn't work out nearly as well as I was hoping. Um, I am supposed to go this way from what I understand. There's like stuff waiting for me here. So if I throw a firebomb here, God, it sounds like somebody is right on top of me. Well, that didn't, that didn't throw nearly as well as I would like. 
And then one there. Didn't help because it didn't kill him. Okay, down you go. Like, that didn't seem to help all that much. Okay, spear guy. Oh no, a good strategy for you, but I'll hopefully figure it out. I had him! There we go! Oh, half moon grasses now. Whoa! God, the timing is so awkward when I when I mistime it once. That's like pretty much it. I mistime it once, the parry, and that that's it. I never did go this way. So let's see what's behind door number blocked. What? Yeah, he's not attacking me. Who who's this? Good day to you. Care to look over my wares. Mostly stolen, but who's telling you? He's a shop. This is a dragling. Okay. Um I was actually told to buy from him. I was told to buy the uh the short spear from him. So I think that's what I'm going to try to do here. And after that I should be good. Thanks for that. Come back soon. I don't see anything here. Um, right. I'm so used to the triangle button being a menu. Um, so I was told that the short spear is actually the way to go. We will see about that, and we'll see if I like it, but uh, apparently if I have the spear, locking on is absolutely necessary, and if I don't do that, I will never land a shot. So, good to know. It's <laughs> probably why so many people recommended it. Um, do I need to? I don't really see a need to. Okay, well, have to be extra cautious again. All right, so they're coming right for me. Once again, I feel like I'm close. There we go. But not close enough. I was told to get the short spear. I don't know why, but I'm I'm gonna trust that. I don't know why I just stood there and took that. All right. I should also have the shield up pretty much at all times. Oh, there's an item over there. Okay. Three crescent moon grasses. That's what I like to see. Okay, so then we can go back up here. We got you. You have posed problems for me in the past. Is he still alive? He still is. Okay, wrong one. There we go. 